Hello everyone, my name is Ken Delschmidt. Uh, I'm the founder of Tea Restore. Along with me is uh, Joseph Hendrickson. My background is as an ophthalmic technician, and his background is an, as a manufacturing engineer. Our, our advisors are Dr. Dan Moradian and Dr. Scott Halsworth, who's a dry eye specialist and one of the leaders in the nation. At Tea Restore, our goal is to provide an effective and consumer-focused treatment for dry eye. Dry eye syndrome affects a minimum of 20 million people in the U.S. and generates $3.2 billion in revenue. This revenue is growing at a compounding rate of 7% per year, and the reason for this is mainly technology. So those smartphones, the computers that you're using day in, day out, is adding to the symptoms of dry eye, including blurred vision, irritation, and worst of all, an inability to use your vision for an extended period of time. The cause of this 90% of the cause of this is meibomian gland dysfunction. The meibomian glands line the upper and lower eyelids and secrete oil onto the tear film with every blink. The treatment for these glands dysfunction is a warm compress treatment. It's a microwave mask, you throw it in the microwave, you put it over your eyes for a minimum of 10 minutes, one to two times a day. The problem with this treatment is that it's ineffective because it supplies an inconsistent amount of heat and it suffers from extremely poor compliance. Our solution is a reusable chemical thermal pack that allows you to utilize your vision throughout the treatment and blink throughout the treatment. This is going to pr provide precise and sustained heat to the eyelids. It's also going to allow you to multitask, so you can make your cup of coffee in the morning, you can read your book in the evening. Additionally, it's going to be more effective than the current treatments because you're going to be expressing those glands when you're blinking uh, in addition to heating them up. Thus far, we've established IP. We uh, have a predicate device that's a class one. Uh, we have a manufacturer in California that's produced uh, initial mold. We've conducted over 70 customer interviews and established relationships with key opinion leaders. Our market enter strategy is to utilize these key opinion leaders along with continuing education and trade shows uh, to establish our brand through private clinician offices. We see a huge potential of growth here uh, with the undiagnosed consumer as well. So once again, at Tear Restore, our mission is to provide an effective and consumer-focused treatment for dry eye syndrome. That's 40 questions. What, just touch on what's the uh, predicate you alluded to and how much capital has been put in so far and how much you need uh, for the next 12 to 24 months? Uh, yes, so the predicate is uh, basically those warming pads that people live with. Uh, yeah, so, uh, and that was in class one. Uh, the, uh, sorry, the, oh, the funding, funding, yeah. So uh, right now we're, we have some funding through the National Science Foundation, uh, through the Innovation Corps program. Uh, we're looking to raise around 200,000, um, and we should be able to get to market in the next six months. Uh, yeah, we're looking for more strategic partnerships, uh, seeing as though the number is quite low. So, so I take it that the strategic partnerships are, will be your sales force for this? Uh, part of them, yeah. The key opinion leading uh, clinicians would obviously have uh, strategic uh, value. Um, but other, other areas of consumer goods and things like that, we need, we need assistance with as well. And I assume the 200000 doesn't address that component. 200000 is for finishing product design and manufacturing scale? Correct, yeah. 